All right, guys, we're down in the basement of Dorothy and Hunter's house um, over in North County area on Park Street. We're going to do a replacement of a furnace, uh, possibly an air conditioner, too. I'll give them the option. Um, but as far as this one goes, uh, there's already been a flue liner installed in the chimney over there, so we're good on that aspect. Um, our return drop will need to be resized just a little bit, I believe. I'll determine that after I do my calculation. It'll be on the checklist. Um, our flue pipe can can stay, so we'll reuse the majority of the um, of the flue. We'll just have a about four foot and two elbows here that we'll end up replacing. Um, let's see here. Actually, you know what? We are going to have to put a trap in and a flue tee. Um, so we'll have to come out of our flue liner here, and we'll put a trap in. Um, or clean out and then uh, and then we'll branch back down so we will end up replacing all of the flu for this system there's currently a humidifier on the system so we will uh, potentially be replacing a humidifier as well our drain lines look like they come out of the back of the unit here they run onto the floor and then across the floor all the way around over to the floor drain so one thing I can bring up is um, a potential of a condensation pump um, to make sure that that always stays nice and clear for them. Our gas line is good in decode. We can reuse the existing gas line. If we do do the air conditioner, we'll just set our new coil on top of our furnace. And we'll run our bypass for the new humidifier. Our refrigerant lines, they come out of the back of the coil here. They go up to the ceiling and they run straight across over to the outdoor unit, which is right out that window. And then my breaker panel is over on this side, so I'm going to take a look at that now. Our breaker panel is a square D load center, and our air conditioner is up on the top. It's a double 30 amp breaker. So my next video will be outside. If we end up replacing this, we'll take the unit off. We'll put uh, a new pad down on the ground, a new disconnect box on the wall. A new whip going into the unit and re insulate this uh, little three foot section of suction line. That should be everything out here.